it's my favorite time of the month it's time to unbox the beers that we've got from the bottle shop this month we're going to craft metropolis they're the uh, they're the bottle shop that we got based in london they've just delivered this beer so let's get ready to rock welcome back to rockers beer review now this is one of my most exciting times of the of the month we've got a box of beers there's a dozen beers in here we've got a few from some uh, breweries that we've tried before and we've got a few from some breweries that we've not tried before and to be honest i ordered it a few days ago and i've tried to think right i can't remember actually what i ordered so i'm going to be as excited hopefully as you are to see what beers we're going to be opening up out of this box this month um, so we've got 12 beers here and um, you know I know these are the beers that we're going to be reviewing over the month of September let's try and get this if we can get this box open we might be able to get the beers um, and let's say Craft Metropolis they're a, they're a new bottle shop I haven't I hadn't seen them before but I saw them advertising they do a thing where you get points so you know the more beer you buy you get points to use off there so we've got um, a bit of packaging there, a bit of excess packaging. And it all looks packaged pretty nice. There we go. So I'm going to get the beers out here and present them here. Let's move that box a little bit out of the way there so we've got a bit more room. Okay, so without further ado, first beer. So the first beer is from Malt Garden. Now we tried a couple last month um, and in fact one of the beers, Forgotten Password, was the beer of the month in August. So. I thought these are brand new they've just come out this is a boosted reality hazy ipa um let's see what it's got it doesn't actually say what hops it's got on it but it's coming in at 5.3 percent and it's in a lovely big 500 mil can uh, apologies when i started this video it wasn't raining it is raining now i'm in the conservatory you may hear a little bit of uh, excess water dropping okay beer number two it's a polys now Polly's again, one of my favourites. You may have seen my review I did uh, the, when I did the beer review of the month that we we talked about doing showcases where we're going to sort of get one brewery um, and do quite a few beers for them over the course of a week. I think Polly's is probably going to be the first one we do just because they release so many and I can't keep up with all the releases, so it'd be good just to have a. a, a um, a beer review from them uh, to have a showcase of their stuff this is the feels volume free and it's a very sort of it's an oat ipa with lacto so i expect it to have a really great body it's called the feels volume free it's coming in at 6.2 percent it's got a zaka citra mosaic and simcoe in it lots of different hops really look forward to, to that as usual because Polly's is the most consistent out of brewery. Okay, so we've got another malt garden here. This is in a lovely pink can. It's called Only Few Words. It's another, um, it's got, it's a double dry hopped hazy IPA with Enigma Galaxy in Idaho 7. So that's another great looking one. 6.1% that is, a bit more, got more alcohol. Again, in a nice big, uh, let's put that together with that one, in a nice big 500 mil can. I mean, these cans look pretty small in comparison. Okay, right, now we've got the last one by Malt Garden. Again, these were brand new releases, so I thought let's buy, it, let's get them while they've just come out, um, and hopefully we'll be one of the first to review them on, the, you know, on YouTube. This is called I'm the Ambassador. This is a double dry hop, double hazy, like before we had a hazy, then we had a double hazy. This is a Zaka, Enigma, and Strata, um, and this is 7.2%, so that's getting a bit high on the old Blotto scale look at them i mean the beautiful cans as well they have this sort of light sort of you know really attractive and and, and really colorful I, lo I love that in their in their cans really good i mean okay next one right so this is a brewer we've not tried before this is the pentrick uh brewing company called shine light millions it's an india palau it's coming in at 6.8 percent this has got citra sabro one of my favorites and simcoe hops so uh, this is, they're based in Pentrick in Derbyshire, um, not tried them before, so again, that's going to be an interesting one uh, and see whether they can be uh, as consistent as some of the other breweries. Okay, we've got another Polly's. 
this one here this one is called intro power slide and it's an IPA um, and it's coming in at 6.7 percent and this is another one with Sabro it's also got El Dorado and Comet um, again really really like this artwork beautiful artwork nice little um, love the the Polly's uh, little logo there let's make sure you can get that so I'm just seeing make sure that you can see all these and how they got it and the rain is starting to really pour down really should be doing more sort of dark beers but I must admit we haven't got any this month pressure drop you know again they were in the top three uh, this one's called palette notes it's a New England IPA coming at 7.4 percent uh, and this one has got this has also got Sabro in it's a little bit of a Sabro theme this month because I, I really I, I really do enjoy Sabro and I really because I really enjoyed it in the forgotten password um, I want to see what other breweries can do with it so this one is Sabro Simcoe Mosaic um, as I said 7.4 percent New England IPA again one of my favorites types of, of, of beer okay so here we've got a uh, beer this is by Howling Hops can see that one there beautifully uh, nice patterned can and it's got that sort of that sort of matte finish to it um, it's in a 440 mil can it's called it's a New England IPA called free fall it's got mosaic citra and Idaho 7 and 7.3 percent another quite high alcoholic alcohol on beer so there's that one there these look at I mean look at color I, just, I look at them on the on the screen there and they look they look beautiful right okay so again another you can see the same you know brightly colored very sort of uh, you know artistic type of um, artwork again this is another one from howling hops this is called push push and it's a double dry hop palau citra azaka and sabro so this is 5.8 percent um yeah another one which has got sabro in it as well i'm looking forward to those new brewery they do quite a few different ones so again see how consistent they are okay next one right okay so the brewery Vedant, another one of my favorite breweries this one has just come out this is called even sharks need water i think i've seen it before and i've then this is a slightly different artwork so maybe they've re-brewed this again this has got citron galaxy 6.5 percent never really had a bad Vedant. let's see how how this one sort of uh, works out let's see if i can just about get them on there We've got one I've got two left so we might have to sort of double up some of these okay so this is another one burning sky this is our sand breweries and blenders again not not been and tried this brewery before you know again a lovely you know artwork some cut some sort of characters on there um, it's got like on the back there we've got plenty of little notes there this is called indecision time and it's a sabro um, so this has got sabro in it it's also got it says sabro 692 what that exactly is i'm not sure and and citra so there's a few different hops these are yeah this is bur burning burning sky i'm not sure where they're where they're based uk based anyway so they're uk based brewery so again new brewery we've not tried it before let's put that one there so you can see that a bit better and then the last one this is track brewery uh this one is called uh going to the sun it says ipa coming at seven percent nice orange can 440 mil can um again this has got vic secret citra equinot uh, as the as the free hops trap brewery again i hear keep hearing loads of great things about them um and they're not the easiest beer to get hold of but this one is there uh, going to the sun seven percent so that's another new brewery um a new beer there we go there's the uh, there's a showcase of what we're going to be reviewing in this month of september um hopefully it will stop raining uh you know because there's nothing there's nothing better than drinking a beer when the sun's shining in my opinion um so these are the beers and and I hope and I look forward to drinking them and I hope you look forward to hearing how I what I think about them and maybe even trying them yourselves if you tried any of these beers let me know tell me which ones I should be drinking first um, and until the next video keep on rocking